New at 10, water warning. The potentially deadly algae covering a lagoon along the lakefront. The Milwaukee Health Department is warning pet owners about blue-green algae in the Veterans Park Lagoon. Now this follows news that a dog in Madison died after ingesting the same type of tainted water. Tom Durian is live at the lagoon tonight with what you need to know, Tom. Well, George Carroll, the health department says they're going to put some signs up here along the lagoon as soon as they can. But right now they're sending that warning out to anybody that might come in contact with the water. It usually happens very fast and it's very lethal. Veterinarian Zachary Rick explains what could happen if a dog ingests tainted water with blue green algae. At Veterans Park tonight, a blue green fogginess to all of the water in the lagoon. It's really hard to tell the difference between safe and dangerous algae. So it's better to, if there's a bloom, it's better to avoid it altogether. Rick says your dog will likely exhibit signs of sickness like vomiting, diarrhea, or a loss of energy within 15 to 30 minutes of exposure rush them to the emergency room and they might have a chance, but there's no guarantee that they'll survive it. We talk with dog owners who hadn't heard the warning. Cousteau, who like his namesake, enjoys the water, just drank from the lagoon yesterday. I was just telling you about the warning. Thankfully, he's probably okay, but it, is it concerning? Well, yeah, that'll be the last time this summer that he drinks out of there. Sophie's owner, Chad, avoids letting her near or in the lagoon. It's not shocking, but I, either way, it's, it's probably a toxic soup of living organisms that, you know, if I wouldn't swim in it, I wouldn't let the dog swim in it. That's some uh, good advice there. Here are some tips from the health department to avoid getting sick if you come in contact with the water. Do not touch the mats or other visible blooms of the algae. Don't swim in or let pets swim in or drink the water, as you heard there. And always wash yourself or your pets after being in the water. Now, the health department is not reporting any sicknesses so far from the water here at the Veterans Park Lagoon. Reporting live tonight, Tom Durian, today's TMJ4. And let's hope it stays that way. Thank you, Tom.